Welcome to Metallurgical Engineering YouTube channel. Today we are going to start the Metallurgy A2Z series. First word is annealing. Annealing is a heat treatment process which alters the microstructure of a material to change its mechanical or electrical properties. Typically, in steels, annealing is used to reduce hardness, increase ductility and help in eliminate internal stresses or residual stresses. What happens in annealing process? During the annealing process, the metal is heated to a specific temperature where recrystallization can occur. At this stage, any defects caused by deformation of the metal are repaired. The metal is held at that temperature for a fixed period, then cooled down to room temperature, furnace cooling or very slow cooling. What are the types of annealing heat treatment process? Here we generally classifies the aniline process in three types. 1. Full annealing. 2. Partial aniline. 3. Subcritical aniline. For example in steels, as you see in the figure, heating above the critical temperatures, AC3 for HYPOEUTECTOID steel, is known as full annealing. Heating between the AC3 and AC1 is known as partial aniline while heating below AC1 is known as subcritical aniline, in all cases hold at heating temperature and slowly cool to room temperature. Other common types of aniline processes are isothermal annealing, diffusion annealing, recrystallization annealing, process annealing, spheridizing annealing. Annealing is a heat treatment process used mostly to increase the ductility and reduce the hardness of a material. This change in hardness and ductility is a result of the reduction of dislocations in the crystal structure of the material being annealed. Thank for watching this video. If you have any questions on aniline process please write on comment section or you can reach us on Facebook and Instagram. Please subscribe our channel for more videos. Stay healthy and stay safe.